I hope that you've been thinking of me, yeah. Good morning, everyone. My name is Dominique Smith, and I'm on a weight loss journey to lose some weight. Sorry about the lighting. I'm at work. I had came a little early because, as you guys know, if you see my video yesterday, I was extremely late. So I came early to help counteract that. I'm trying to find something. Oh, there you go. <laughs> but, yeah, you guys, I'm a little late. This don't look too nice because then people think I'm recording them. But, yeah, you guys, um... I just want to touch on a little bit of what happened yesterday, you guys. Sorry about all that. If you guys join me on that crazy coaster ride, I'm sorry about that, you guys. I'm going to do what I have to do. But I just want to say something. I think a lot of my problem has to do with the scale. Because the scale freaking discourages me. Like, as you guys know, my plateau area is 249 to 253, right? This morning when I got on the scale, I was 253. But, at the beginning of my journey, I took measurements. I only measure one place, around my belly button. And this is what it said around my belly button when I first started this journey. Hopefully it'll stay right here. When I first started my journey, around my freaking stomach was 55, right? This morning, when I took, first of all, my weight is still up there. So somebody lying. It was 55, but this morning when I got off the scale and I said, you know what, let me take my measurements, it was right here. Right here, you guys. Y'all see how much of a loss that is? It went from 55 all the way to 49 and some change. Like, I'm literally close to 48. So, I'm doing something wrong as far as the scale goes, but I'm also doing something right as far as these inches. Like, I'll take it. I really want to see a change on the scale, but I'll take these inches, though, too, you guys. But that scale is getting on my nerves. That scale is freaking lying or something. Or maybe it's muscle. I don't know. Because I was walking, like, every day on my lunch break. And then from walking, I went to jumping rope. But you guys know I've been jumping rope for the past week. My first day skipping was yesterday because, like I told you, my mat and my jump rope is in my car. But my boo had my car yesterday when it was time for me to do my jump rope. So... It is what it is, you guys. I'm not quitting. Although yesterday, if you seen my roller coaster ride video yesterday, I was like so just ready to just give up and quit. I'm not going to quit, you guys. I'm going to do what I have to do. It's a journey. It's a real bumpy road journey for me. Like I've been going up and down, up and down. But that's my fault because I'm not doing what I'm supposed to do. So that don't mean I get to try to run to the next diet or next lifestyle. No, I need to do what I have to do in this one. So with that being said, you guys, let's get today. Let's do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do my jump rope. I'm going to do everything that I have to do. So let's go. I need to go ahead and go into work now because I'm sure one of my kids is in there waiting for me. So Thank you guys for watching. I love all you guys. Tasha Dixon, girl, yes. Thank you. I read all your comments. I love you. You keep me going just as much as you say I keep you going. Thank you so much. Savage Beauty Ways, you had my back yesterday when I was struggling. We was going back and forth talking. You was over there laughing, cracking up, but I was really over there struggling. And, of course, oh Mad Caroline, I love you too. 100 to Life of Fat Girls Journey. Just everybody who helps uplift me, Finding Jilly, everybody who's been uplifting me and helping me thank you so much you guys i'm not going to quit i'm going to do what i have to do love you guys mom jackie be tripping babe g row you already know everybody already know if i didn't mention you i already know okay i love you guys i gotta go to work okay bye so as i was walking into work i was reading some more of the comments and spoken word illusions he wrote a comment saying that most of the time, things that happen, like what happened to me yesterday, happens to people right before their breakthrough. I hope he's right, y'all. I really hope he's right, because I sure need a breakthrough. But this is what I just got on, you guys. I got this uh, mustard shirt on. These pants, again, y'all have seen this before. And those shoes. And that's what's going on, you guys. 
I'm going to do it. I'm going to stick to it. I see the difference. I definitely see the difference. But I don't like that scale. I don't like it, you guys. It's rude. I don't know if I need to zero it out or something, but it's got to be lying. Somebody lying. And it ain't the magic the tape thing because I did that manually. But <sighs> it is what it is, you guys. Alright, let me go get this over with. Hey you guys, so it is now 10.04. I'm doing good, you guys. I've been wanting to pop in a piece of gum just for something, but I know some people say gum breaks your fast. So let me know, you guys. Do you guys think I should start popping in a piece of gum when I'm feeling like snackish or eaty and it's not my eating window? Let me know. Or should I just keep sticking it out with water, which is where I'm heading right now. I'm heading into the office to go fill this up. So I <sighs> just wanted to give you guys a quick little update. I'm staying strong, you guys. I feel a breakthrough coming. A breakthrough is definitely, definitely coming, you guys. All done, you guys. And look, I got on another pair. I love these. <laughs> hey, you guys, it's 11.35 and I'm hungry. So I just popped in one of those gums. And I feel great about it. It's better than me going to get another roll of Ritz crackers. Just tell me what you guys think in the comments. And it is what it is, you guys. 11.35, I'm chewing some gum. You guys, I'm officially off work. I'm on my way. Well, I'm actually here in my little honey bun school to pick her up. I already went and signed her out. Now I'm just waiting for her to walk up here. So I'm about to go back in there and see if she's there. She should be here by now, you guys. But I'm about to get her and take her to her doctor's appointment. And then I'm officially on my way home to eat. So I'll see you guys when I get there. Here go my little honey. <coughs> you ready to go to the doctor, baby? Yeah. We both coughing, huh? You might have to get a shot. No. I'm sorry. You're a big girl, though, right? I tried before, but then I didn't cry. Okay. I always brave like, like that. Yeah, just do like that, okay? All right, you guys. I'll see you guys once we get to it's the doctor. It's hey, baby, we got to go this way. This way. This way. Yes. It looks so nice out here, you guys. Nice and calm. And relaxing. It looks beautiful. It looks beautiful, baby. I think we're going this way. You look beautiful. <laughs> All right, Bye you guys. I like your I love your face. <laughs> All right, you guys. So now we're just waiting for her to be called. Are you ready? Are you going to cry? You're not going to cry? I tried before and I didn't cry. All right, we're going to cry. I better not be a shot. No. <laughs> Y'all, I'm home now. It is 3.21 and I'm about to eat. Let me show you guys what I'm eating. Here it is. A big old, well, it's not that big of a plate, but a plate of rice and beans that I'm about to sprinkle some cheese on. Yes, finally. And I'm going to stick to you guys. I'm going to not eat nothing else after this. Probably. I might have like some fruit or something, but this is it, you guys. My beans, rice with some cheese on top. You guys, hold on. A rude airplane. A rude and beautiful airplane. But hey, you guys, I just got off um, live with C-Dub. Hi, Taisha Lafayette and DV. You guys are awesome. But I'm about to go ahead and do my jump rope while it's still light outside. And y'all can see, as y'all know, this is day nine for me. So far, I only skipped day eight. So let's get it going, y'all. Let me set up. And I'm going to try to set y'all right here on this gate to see if that works hopefully it works and if so when i'm at home this will be my new jump rope spot let's see you guys oh you guys i literally just recorded this for you guys but it looked like my freaking boob was gonna pop out the whole time so like i said y'all a little close but let's do this i'm gonna record it again for you guys and i did like 47 jumps this last time too let's see if i can do it again oh gosh come on boobs 
Okay. Now, <laughs> I'm about to do that for the next 10 minutes, <sighs> and I'll be back once I'm done. <sighs> All right, you guys, <sighs> that's my 10 minutes, but I'm going to keep jumping because I don't feel like that was good enough, so I'm going to keep jumping. Another part of the reason why I don't feel like that was good enough is because <sighs> like a minute or so, probably, or less than that, my mom and my boo decided they wanted to try, so... I let them try, but I'm going to jump some more because I'm still out here and I still feel like it, and because I um, didn't really jump yesterday. <sighs> so, yeah, you guys. I'll see you guys in the next little part, whatever that's going to be. Oh, look at the daddy. Go the daddy. Go the daddy. Ooh, you ain't showing me nothing new asset. You, you yeah, two more. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Guys, I don't know how much extra time I done jump roping, but y'all can barely see me now. I'm still out here jumping, y'all. I'm not even timing it anymore. I'm just having fun, so... Just letting you guys know, I done made up for today and yesterday, so, yes. So, I was in the house now. Y'all look what my boo did. Ooh, I love when he do stuff like this. He washed the mountain, you guys. <gasps> he washed the mountain down to the crock pot, so. Oh, yes. I was just about to, whew, that thing is heavy. I was just about to put up the mountain and guzzle my water and probably make some more rice to go with the rest of these beans and call it so let me start the water for that we don't need much rice so i can use this little one this time i'll just make one cup of rice but yeah y'all everything is copacetic everything is awesome i did my workout yay more than my share me and my honey was going back and forth and when you're doing freaking jump rope or some type of exercise with the kid, they don't know when to stop. So she's like, come on, mommy. One, two, three. We jump, we jump, she mess up. One, two, three. We jump, we jump, she mess up. One, two. So I'm like, okay, baby, my baby giving me some hit in for today. I will take it. And that was after I did my 10 minutes. So I'm all for it, baby. I'm all for it. So, y'all, with that being said, I'm not doing anything. Just about to make this rice. And then probably take a shower. And then probably after that, I'll probably just be back. I'm just pouring salt in the water. I pour salt and a little bit of um, oil in my rice water. So, yeah. That's all I'm doing, you guys. Just making this. Get my uh, oil. Just making this rice and calling it, you guys. So, most likely after this right here. I'll just be back to close out the vlog. I hope you guys enjoy, but that's too early to be saying. I'll tell you guys that in a minute. Let's watch back the clip that I just said, you guys, and the rice that I'm making is not for me. I'm not eating anything else tonight. I don't have my meal. I'm making it for my family, just to clarify that. <laughs> Aren't you guys? Everybody's eating. Everybody's happy. Everybody's well taken care of. Mommy is done for today. I'm about to go and take my shower. Wash this off my face. Wash thine mm, from the Ruta to the Tuta. And I'll see you guys in the morning. That live was awesome. Thank you, C Dub, for being an awesome host. And thank you um, to all my new real ones who came over there. Came over here from over there, y'all, the bomb.com. But I always do this, even though I just said that. Hello, 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 hello to all my new real ones. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for watching. And I'll see all you beautiful real ones tomorrow, bright and early in the morning for work. Bye.